I've never heard of such a thing, Mr. Roth. A venerated studio like yours sending out unplayable prints of a major release like East of Eden? I'm as baffled as you, Ms. Lodge. At any rate, please accept our deepest apologies for this mishap. I'll accept your apology, but what I really want is a pristine copy of East of Eden. And what I want is audiences in Riverdale to see this picture. I do, it's a wonderful picture, but I'm afraid that there are no more available prints. You sent me a defective product. How is this my problem? Ms. Lodge. Veronica, may I call you Veronica? You're the theater owner. It's always your problem. You'd know that if you weren't so green. Green? Let me assure you. I'm so sorry, but I need to let you go. I'm having lunch at the Polo Lounge with Monty Clift. But good luck to you. How does a major studio run out of prints of their biggest release of the year? I don't know. But luckily, they're not the only studio in town. It's time to work the phones, boys. I have Pasadena pictures. Nikki! Veronica Lodge. No, Nikki, I'm in exhibition these days. The Babylonium in Riverdale. Listen, my customers simply don't have time for that Steinbeck yawner. I need something exciting, something fresh. Do you have any available prints of To Catch a Thief? I'm hearing great things about Hitchcock's latest. Word around town is that Oklahoma is a masterpiece. What about this Night of the Hunter I keep reading about? It's our KO. Be that as it may, Miss Lodge, we've already booked our picture at the Orpheum. Unfortunately, Riverdale isn't a market we're interested in cultivating. Silver Shield Studios. I'm sorry, but we're being very particular about how we're distributing musicals this year. Superior. Furthermore, all of our current releases demand larger theaters. Please don't call us again. But sir, you used to send us your movies every week. What changed? I don't do business with underage would-be impresarios, especially not when I'm trying to get into business with their parents. But good luck to you, Miss Lodge. You'll need it. Well, there you have it, boys. I and the Babylonium have been blacklisted by every major studio in Hollywood. Why, though? If I had to hazard a guess, my parents. I've been waiting for this penny loafer to drop since I bought the theater out from under them. My last call confirmed it, but honestly, I suspected sabotage from the moment we got that bad print. What do your parents want? To see everyone but themselves fail, including their own daughter. I'm sure they want the Babylonium to shutter so they can buy it for me at a discount and turn it into a parking lot. I have an idea. So far, we've only tried the major studios, but there are a lot of smaller independent places out there. They're scrappy and they don't play by the same rules. Their movies don't have big stars or budgets or prestige. In other words, they're B-movies, but they're still movies. Good idea, Clay. Boys, if we're going down, we're going down fighting. Get me one of those smaller studios.